Hi, everybody. Uh, all right, I got a couple friends over. I got my buddy Hipster, uh, Hipster Santa, and Officer First Officer are helping me put the canopy on. They were just getting ready to go fly. I hadn't seen them in a while, so just shooting a little breeze. In this, uh, in the last video, we finished sizing up, or I should say, shifting the right cam lock flanges on, along the right side of the fuselage. In this video, we are going to do all of the drilling. So in the next video, we'll be putting the cam locks on. In this video, we're going to finish now that the canopy is sanded down to size. You can see, look at that. Doesn't that look nice? So what we're doing is we're going to go and just do the initial drilling on all of these uh, locations and then click with them on. Again, so it, you can see without the top cowling on, it's so easy just to reach, uh, reach in with your hand, put that magnetic insert in, put the magnetic ball on the outside, center it, mark it, then drill it. And then you just click the uh, insert in. Now, the, the thing about the cam lock kit is that it only comes with, I think, 10 of those Clico inserts. So you have to use them sparingly, right? So if you use like, you know, four along the sides, well, that's very strong. That's how it's going to hang natural. But then you only have two inserts used on the bottom, right? Uh, as I've got three along the bottom. And you'll see me getting underneath to do those. So now this is the right side. This is where there's going to be a little bit of a discrepancy between uh, <laughs> Uh, between where the uh, bottom two flanges are, but no big deal. And there we go. So uh, now uh, jumping straight to the bottom ones. Now there's three along the bottom on each side. I'm pretty sure I'm probably going to lose one to um, where the exhaust is coming up, and that'll be the center one. I'm still waiting on my exhaust to get back. Uh, but it'll be coming out of the sides and not through the center tunnel. Though I did have that option, but I thought, eh, mm, nah, I'd rather them coming out the sides. That's fine. So, yeah, uh, once these are all drilled, so uh, we've got enough of those Clico inserts on the bottom. We'll be happy with that. And then we're going to do the top. Uh, basically, the only thing after this, so in the next video, you'll see how these cam locks are put on. At this point, all you have to do is use that insert, the Clico insert, sort of as a bullseye, as you enlarge the holes to 11.30 seconds apiece. At that point, you can then put the grommet in that comes with the kit, and then put together an actual ca uh, cam lock Clico thing. I'll show you pictures of that in the next video. Uh, you have to have a special pair of pliers, of course, to put the to put the cam locks together. Because why wouldn't you? Oh no, and it doesn't come with the kit. So, but I'll show you all that. All right, so bottom's done. We're happy. Oh crap! That reminds me, I got to do the oil door. I hadn't done it yet. All uh. right. So obviously it's much easier to get to the top ones on the right side of the cowling than it would be on to the left because you only have one oil door. Uh, I mean with the bottom cowling off you can still get to like the first four or five on the left side and that's fine. Of course at that point you're also getting dangerously close to where that second battery is. Uh, so yeah, the last three or four we did have to wind up doing it the hard way with uh, using tape. So you tape the insert into the cam lock flange and then put the cowling on and then uh, go from there right because the, the magnets already in it so you just put the magnetic ball on top and works pretty well alright in the next video the actual cam locks go in place start to go in place so thank you for joining me everyone see you soon